update for my 2007 Ram. Uh, in case you haven't been following, this motor is actually a 2019 6.7 swapped into my 2007. I have the CP4 CP3 uh, SNS diesel conversion. Um, down there, you can see the CM2450 ECM. Um, Notice the difference is I have the 5.9 valve cover. I updated uh, my turbo setup, so I'm running a Steed Speed exhaust manifold. That's the VGT manifold with uh, an Aurora 6K um, compound kit, and then I'm using a stock uh, whole set VGT below it. <clears throat> but what I wanted to show you is my edge. So. Kind of disappointing. The the edge odometer only reads 300,000. So if you're over 300,000 miles, um, it'll actually just read zero. <clears throat> so my truck has 350,000 miles on it right now. So what I'm actually doing to get this number is the controller is looking at the current mileage. It's subtracting the, the mileage I had when I did the swap. So obviously you have to look at it. Um, you subtract that and then I'm re-adding the mileage I was on the motor. So when I bought the motor, it only had 24,000, uh, 2,400 miles on it. So still a pretty, uh, pretty low mileage motor. The other update to this is uh, vehicle speed. <clears throat> so I'm actually converting the ABS module to, uh, to what the RAM engine wants to see. Well, the ECM wants to see. So now the OBD2 data from the engine is actually telling telling me what my actual vehicle speed is. So that's really cool too. And then go around the block real quick and you'll be able to see the, the odometer increase. to 63 oh yeah the other thing once I got all this work in my uh, instant average and my economy average on my uh, fuel consumption actually started populating
So it's saying 73%. Yeah, pretty close. Um, same thing with uh, the horsepower, load, all that now gets translated. I drive may not. Let's try this. But, uh, but yeah, and that's pretty much the, the current update. I'm actually looking at having a uh, piece made right here. So I'll actually put two rocker switches, and this is where I'm planning on putting uh, the exhaust brake. So you'll have your auto brake and then full brake, just like it would on uh, 13 and newer. But, uh, but yeah, that's so far it. I'm still tinkering with it, still uh, updating it. Should start getting connectors in, um, hopefully here in another month or two, and then I can start building some prototype harnesses and and see how it actually works. But cool, thanks for watching.